ready? Ready? Well, come on. Morning. Happy Saturday. It's a brisk one, but it is warming up. The sun is coming up. It's starting to unthaw a little bit. Had some frost. Jason's already back here uh, figuring out what we need to take over with us today. We are working at the new barn site. This will be a true test to Jason's and I's marriage, I have a feeling. Well, maybe he isn't back here. That's all right. I need to get the skill loader anyway, get some hay brought up. So take a few minutes for the skid loader to uh, warm up anyway. So, we'll just talk. Okay, so we'll just talk a minute because it's been a while. Well, it's not really been a while. It's just been a few minutes. Um, if you guys follow us on social media, on Instagram or any of the platforms, you guys might have noticed I've taken, it's not going to sit there, Kayla. Here. Nope. Just hold you. Um, you guys might have noticed that I've taken a little bit of a step back from being continuously on my stories or posting and yada, yada, yada. I didn't need a break. <laughs> um, so I took one. It was kind of nice. Uh, I even took a break from like carting you guys around too. I am finally feeling a little bit more leveled out. Um, just takes a while. New meds, whatever else to get in my system and kind of help. Uh, let's see. I think we're finally done with all things like corn harvest. Jason may have to go back and help um, Gatlin and Devin a little bit more, but I probably won't have to go over there as far as I uh, kind of know right now. We are going to start working on this barn site. <clears throat> it's going to be our cattle barn facility. It'll have our chutes, our working pen chutes over there, which is very much needed. Um, for the last several years, we've just kind of made do. We bring a cows home, and it's just not always convenient uh, the way we have it set up right now. So we're gonna do better. Everything is always about doing better and learning more and whatnot. So we're gonna put this barn up. It's gonna have our working pen in it. It's gonna have some attorney pens in it, um, so that when we start calving these heifers in January, um, we are more prepared. Missouri weather is kind of finicky. It can be a wonderful January, a crappy February, and a beautiful March. Or we can have 75 degrees on Christmas and then two weeks later be negative 10. So Missouri's kind of this, you just never really know how the weather's gonna go. So calving for us is when Jason and I are not busy. So what do we do January through March? Sell hay relax, rest, maintenance equipment. It's our least, most busy time. Um, we've always calved spring and fall until this year. We did not do a fall calving cycle, so we put all the cows in one side. It's been a relief off my shoulders, and I know his, because we're not having to stress about getting over to check um, calving cows. So, that's where we're at. Probably talk more about the cows, like, just going on through um, the next several videos and whatever else. We are also, let's see, what else are we doing? That's about it, this barn. And then like getting the shop lined out. Um, that's been kind of an ongoing process too. Um, him and his dad worked on it yesterday to lay some electrical lines and whatnot. So then we'll power the concrete eventually. It's just, since COVID hit, is that even a word that I'm allowed to say on here? Um, since the, backwards, since it hit, um, things have just been kind of out of whack. So people that are really good are really busy and we want quality. So yeah, we just had to kind of wait, just 
name of the game sometimes. So, I think we're just about warmed up, hopefully. Maybe give it just a little bit longer. And we'll go get some hay. Cow pie is slowing me down. Come your way. Whoa, 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 too much. What? Someone got me. What? So, somewhere right in here, I need to pound these in, and then you don't really need them this tall, but Move them up and down so we can get string to figure out that we're square. So actually, I could probably make some more off of these, can't I? Mm -hmm. yeah. What do you think, Ryder Man? Oh my gosh, you guys. Please make sure you like this video. Otherwise, we may not do any more of the barn construction um, for you guys. Ah, it is an a 40 by 81. We're gonna do nine foot center, so it makes it a little bit easier math-wise. I had to dig out algebra skills and figure out the square root of it so we could figure out our cross points. And then we double checked my math by calling, phoning a friend, phoning a friend. I don't remember what game show that was off of, but you phone a friend. All right, so we'll, uh, I'm gonna go put a screw down here. We'll get a line again. We'll have to tie this one off. Okay. Okay. Finally made it. 
to the skid loader. Whew. Got the planter kind of stuck in. Just a bit chilly. Good to me. You ready? Yeah, put that concrete in. No, not yet. We need to put concrete in. You got a bucket in? Thank you. 